Hi, you're listening to the Choose Joy podcast, and I'm Tisa, your host. Here at Choose Joy, I pray for you, and we watch God work. Let's pray. I pray that God gives you an ear to hear and a heart to listen. I thank God for giving you precise hearing and clarity today. When you listen, you will get exactly what you were supposed to receive. There will be no misunderstandings. There will be no miscommunications. It is my prayer that broken relationships be restored because you listened and received without filtering the message through hurt feelings or a history of past conversations. The Word of God says, let everyone be swift to hear, slow to speak, and slow to wrath. So today, I pray that you talk less and listen more and watch your relationships be strengthened by your listening and made better by your thoughtful responses. It is my prayer for you today that you also know that God is always speaking. I pray that you set aside space in your day to hear from the Lord. Then don't just hear what God is telling you to do. Do it. I believe that you will be blessed today when you listen. If you believe and agree, say amen, because all things are possible with God. Amen. Thank you so much for praying with me here today at Choose Joy with Tisa. You know, it's hard to listen when you are busy formulating a response or trying to catch the person saying something that contradicts a previous conversation. It is hard to listen when you don't value anyone else's thoughts or perspectives. It is extremely hard to listen when you are talking or complaining. I don't know what your challenge is with listening, But I pray that you take a close look today. Pray to God to fix it right now. If you are listening, I challenge you to listen to God to speak through your situations. I pray that you listen for God in your music. Listen for God even in your storms and in your droughts. I promise you that if you listen, God will speak. I hope that you will join me for tomorrow's prayer. And if today's prayer was for you, let me know by leaving me a comment at tisajones.com. I believe we all know someone who needs this message. So I, I pray that you share it with them. And until the next time, I pray that you choose joy. Amen.